Everything heavy when we step up. You can't hang with a gang, you a fellow. Yeah, everything check, come Stella. Welcome, beautiful people. I am Chef B. If you're new to this channel, welcome, welcome. Make sure you are subscribed down below. In today's video, I want to give you guys something a little bit different than my usual try and haul. So, I just came back from vacation and of course, I took a bunch of pictures. Uh, I didn't do a try on haul before I went because if you guys saw my last vlog, it was a whole lot going on and I didn't get the time to do all of that. However, I decided that I wanted to do like a lookbook type of video for you guys just to show you the pieces that I wore on vacation and some of the pictures that I already posted on Instagram. A lot of you had questions about where I got a couple stuff you know my style all that good stuff all that jazz so here we are so i want to give you all the 411 and all the pieces that i got now the first outfit that i posted it was very simple very basic very chic in a sense it's just like your typical outfit that you wear so the shorts i got from zara and i wear a size 10 at zara um sometimes i could get away with a size 8 but my Hips are a 43 inch and my waist is a 30. So to stay on the safe side so it doesn't give me that like mushroom top, have my love handle squeezing all together, I go for a size 10 at Zara. So I'm gonna try to find the shirts for you guys because I did buy it in store. I'm gonna try to find a link online and do it for you. The top I got for a pretty little thing and I got that in a size eight. My bust measurement is 36 inches and Pretty Little Thing is a UK brand so they do UK sizing. I think I'm a UK size 12 and a US size 8. I paired that off with some sandals that I got from Zara and I was so in love with these sandals. The freaking cutest simple sandals ever. Inexpensive. They're, they were like 56 Canadian dollars I believe and then just to add a little flair to the look, I paired it, or not paired it, it's one item. I added a Louis Vuitton purse, my go-to crossbody bag. The look is complete. Now, the accessories that I'm wearing, I got on Instagram. It's from this store called Fancy Couture, and it is black owned. That is where I get most of my chunky type of jewelry. So the earrings that I'm wearing even right now is from Fancy Couture. On Instagram so you want to check out that page because their jewelry is fine. Moving on to the next fit. Now the next fit, it wouldn't be a fit, it's a swimsuit. The swimsuit I got from Shein. Now Shein is like the go-to for a lot of things. You feel me girlfriend? Like this top is from Shein. So this bathing suit I got in a size medium and again with all my measurements, swimsuits can be tricky but I knew this swimsuit would have stretch to it. One piece also can be tricky because you want to make sure that it has the stretch or you're going to look all stuffed up like a stuffed chicken and you don't want that so i went with a medium in this swimsuit this white swimsuit was like freaking long it fits so comfortable it covered everything that i wanted to cover i'm not gonna lie to y'all sometimes i do get a little body conscious even though y'all see me dipping in and doing it and doing all type of things sometimes i wanna you know in swimsuits i go for either a one piece or i go for a three piece set because i want the option if i want to cover up and all of that just because not all the time and that's okay it is okay even the most slender of girls sometimes get self-conscious with their body at the beach so three piece or a one piece is my go-to and this white one piece she was back she was fitting comfortable on the crotch she was holding the booty in together and covering where it needs to be covered and she had me snatched and looking all types of good okay love handles be damned in that swimsuit you feel me uh, okay and of course you know i had to bring the toffee on the trip i brought three tofer bags on this trip okay so i paired it with my white to why do you think paired it's one item i added my white telfar to the to the look and the sandals i got from Simi london um i'm a size seven or eight in Simi london it just depends but the whole fit together 
very simple but she's banging for the beach you feel me now this next swimsuit set also from Shein as I said if it's not a one piece I'm gonna go with the three piece okay she is just freaking Bob she 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 was giving everything that I need to give on the beach the color was vibrant the fit was phenomenal the material was decent for a cheap swimsuit now I must say the panties of the fit fit a little bit tight on the waist because I did get a medium I feel like if I got a large, then the cover-up would be too baggy on me, but I definitely needed a bigger size in the bottoms for the swimsuit. And also, I don't know what it is with a lot of companies. It's like they're making the swimsuit bottom smaller in the crotch part, in the vagina part. It's just like, when did we start like wanting our lips to be out? Like, I don't want that. I need more coverage in the front and in the back. Why are that a compromise? To be honest, I was so confused if the front was actually the back and supposed to be one of the thong, but actually it was the front that was smaller. They're making swimsuit front, the crotch part, so small, and I'm not digging that. So y'all come thinking, you need to fix that up because some of us are fat in the front and the back, okay? You need to fix it up. Of course, you know, I got the telfy with it. Had to add the telfy to that because I had the mint green tail part and I just didn't know what to wear it with. I've been trying to find things to wear it with for the longest time and the swimsuit did it for me. I also paired it with Simi London sandals. Again, size 7 or 8 in Simi London. It depends on how it fit because these sandals did fit a little bit small so I should have gotten a size 8. But yeah, the green of the Simi sandals, the Simi London sandals, it says mint. I thought they would match but obviously different types of mint apparently and they didn't go well together well they did go well together just that the color was off but it, do, it doesn't have to be perfect and we're cool with that right we're cool with that and the shades i got from shein i've worn these shades quite a number of times the same shades nothing strange now, moving on to my favorite set now i'm not gonna even say my favorite because this set was one of my faves it was giving me sheet classy and a little bit of sexy this set was doing everything that i needed it to do this set is from fashion nova i already featured it in a previous try on haul i got this set in a large i knew i needed a large bottom there was no way i could go for medium art just it just wouldn't fit properly and I don't know if I lost a little bit of weight, you feel me, but uh, it did fit bigger than it did the first time that I tried it. The waist, which I'm not mad at, was a little bit bigger, but the waist being a little bit bigger, it helped hide my love handle. So it looked like I was just real smooth on the side. So get a size up, I would recommend because the boob, the boob can always be adjusted. I'm not exactly a part of the itty bitty titty community anymore, but having a bigger top that can tie, because it was a tie top, having a bigger top that could tie, I could adjust it to make my boobies sit up or however I want it. So always go for the size that fits your bottom in a two piece. I added a bag that I got from. Where did I get this bag from? I got this bag from Shein. And I didn't like the straps that the bag came with. So I removed the straps from it because it was pink. I didn't even realize the straps were pink. I thought it was gold to be honest. So I removed the straps and then I used my Louis Vuitton straps from my Louis Vuitton purse. Added to that and there, she's bagging. She's bagging because the gold straps look so much better. And also these sunglasses, these shades, I got again from Fancy Couture on Instagram, Black Own. I love these shades. These shades are like my fave shades of right now. They're just giving real vibe. Like no doubt about it. Shabba with a bag of tea. That shade is banging. To finish off the look, I added these sandals from Fashion Nova. Last minute addition to my vacation like last minute package i just threw it in there to match with the bag now baby baby this next fit right here now this fit is literally one of my favorite fits this skirt 
was way better than I imagined it to be. No front, no tea, no shade towards the model, but baby, that skirt in person is way better than it looked on the website. And that says a lot about a lot of items that you see on a website as opposed to when you get it. But it looks way better in person. I love this skirt. Now, I got this skirt in a size 8. Um, that was tricky for me. Let me just double check to see if I really got that skirt in a size 8 because I really can't remember. I indeed got that skirt in a US size 8 and it fit. Sometimes, depending on the waist of certain bottoms, I have to go a little bit higher. So I'll go for a large. But with this skirt, I went for a medium size, the medium 8. And girl, it fit. It fit great. It wasn't squeezing on the waist. It just sits right on me. It just sit there and it was just banging. It made my booty look bigger than how it already is big. And the color was so vibrant. It was so beautiful. Like the skirt, the skirt was banging. The tube top I got from Pretty Little Thing as well. Pretty Little Things, they can be a hit and miss sometimes with clothing depending on the quality because I can tell you I had some misses with Pretty Little Thing but I decided to trust them this time around and I'm glad I did because they really, the color delivered with that look. Now the sandals I got from Shein and I got that in a size 8 and the purse you know how we support black owned businesses? What color trunk is this? I don't know if it has a special name, but it's just an orange neon green. Neon, oh, neon green child, I don't know color. It was a neon orange brown and black wood trunk. This fit was not planned. It was just that I was looking for something to wear to brunch. Saw the skirt. Okay, I'm gonna wear the skirt because it's bright outside. You know what? The skirt got a hint of yellow in it. Let me just pair it with these bright ass yellow sandals then we don't want to go extra too extra on the top since the skirt is doing everything that it needs to do i'm gonna just put on a white tube top with it and hey i got a brand new black with neon orange trunk i'm gonna just add that in there because why not just color block a little bit more in this next fit baby i i showed y'all this dress in my um Boohoo! Boohoo trying out. This dress is from Boohoo and I'm wearing a US size 8, UK size 12 in this dress. Now this dress, even though I said it also in the trying haul, it was a little bit tricky in terms of the wraparound situation that was going on in the front and also the sides were a little bit tight for a size 8. Like everything else fit nicely, even to the point where the tummy part was a little bit big so I could even imagine if I went a size up it would be like too big at the bottom so it was a little bit weird on the size of how tight fitting around the waist however because it was so fitted around the waist it gave me a nice hourglass type of shape where it was like smoothing down my love handle and just making my back look phenomenal and then giving that booty that pop so i'm not even mad at it you know it's a little bit of awkward tightness it did what it needed to do to give me that hourglass and that boom 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 so i'm not even gonna complain too much i'm gonna just leave it there personally for myself vacation especially in the caribbean i like flats i like sandals i'm a sandals type of girl i'll get cheap sandals medium price sandals expensive sandals like Sandals are my thing. I'll spend money on sandals. I don't know if it's the Jamaican in me because I'm used to wearing flats, but I would I would spend money on sandals before I spend money on shoes. I would I would rather wear sandals. It depends on the look because it's more comfy than wear heels. So with this look, I could have gone with heels or flats. I was in Angola. The 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 walkway to get to the restaurant that I was going to was a little bit rocky. I could not imagine scruffing the heels of my 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 whatever heels it was to get to this restaurant. So no, I'm gonna wear flat. So even though it's rocky, my Gucci sandals didn't get damaged or anything, even though it had some rock marks on the bottom of it, it was fine, you know what I'm saying? It's under the bottom as long as the sides don't get scruffed up, you feel me? So I paired it with the Gucci sandals and my Gigi purse completed the look 
it's giving sexy yet simple like i wasn't trying too hard at least i think i wasn't trying too hard but it gave it gave everything that i needed it to give to give a vacation look now you can pair it with heels if you want to i'm not a heels type of now I didn't really wear much accessories with this I just paired it with this earring that I'm wearing right now and I got this from Fancy Couture as well like girl I, I really got I really love the Google Chunky accessories on that side now my next swim set also a three-piece I got from Shein and baby she is doing everything the color is lively it's vibrant I love how it's kind of mesh see-through so it's still giving that sexy the sunglasses I also got from Shein I got this in a size 8 so a medium size and it fit me so well again I'm having issue issues with the panty parts of the swimsuit that I think um, Shein needs to address like we don't need the crotch to be so freaking small so I had to keep it on because I feel like the crotch was doing too much Okay, it was doing way more than it needs to. So for the entire time that I was on that yacht, I kept the cover up off because I'm trying to have my coochie lips all out in these ugly streets. So to this next bit. Now this set is so simple, adorable, yet I am so in love with it. It's so my style. Like sometimes I can be a little boohoo chic with it. Sometimes I can be a little sexy with it. It depends on whatever my vibe is, but this set was representing me. Now, I got this from Boohoo, also in my Boohoo try on haul, so you want to check that out if you haven't already. Now, I got this in a UK size 12, US size 8, and the set is just simple and phenomenal at the same time. Something so simple could be so freaking baggy you feel me so it's not like you're trying too hard it's giving very much vacation even though the color is black but it's giving vacation chic vacation greatness if you will so again i had my gucci slides not slides child. i had my gucci thong sandals add that to it with the gg purse complete the look so it went from simple with a hint of expensive and just giving a little bit of chic and it's doing everything that it needed to give the fit was great the skirt just sat on me it wasn't squeezing it wasn't doing too much it was just a really great fit right the fit was freaking phenomenal and again with the blue part it was holding the tatas together the girls were sitting really cute they were behaving and it was just doing everything again i used or paired it with these earrings like i wore these these um the same earring is it jamaica didn't even say earring i wore these in almost every other outfit that i wore because these were just my staple accessory for this vacation like it was just doing everything now this dress is from pretty little thing and i got this in a size eight this dress, I am so in love with it because it was giving me classy sexy. It was doing just that. The fit was great. There wasn't much else or isn't much else to say about this dress. How it you see it on the website is how it is. Um, even though I had the back out and the back tires were out, let the love handles be free because they were just sitting there doing what they needed to do. The dress that fit my body greatly. I love the straps around it the color everything was easy to get into the dress was doing everything that it needed now the sandals i got from shein shein has really nice simple sandals that you can get and wear for vacation if you're looking for something inexpensive these brown chocolate sandals are just it's like you need them in your closet again i went in with these shades these shades were banging the shades that listen let me tell you i love these shades yeah i'm not even understand how much i love them shades here and to complete this look i just added my louis vuitton purse and bada bing bada boom that's it for her she was she was doing everything and i wore this on a sunday so you know it's giving it's giving sunday classy but i want to be a little bit sexy with it now on to my last 
look for vacation honestly i wore other things on vacation but i didn't take a picture in so i don't want to put it out there unless i end up wearing um the outfits maybe on the next vacation in a month or two um but this last outfit y'all y'all see how i love me some yellow yellow against melanated skin is something something magical it is something so freaking magical about melanin against yellow it's just freaking beautiful now this set i got from shein and you buy the skirt and the top separately the top it's a wrap top i got that in a size small because i'm like it's a whole lot of material like i don't think i need to get a medium in it or my boobs are gonna get lost in the socks. So I went with a small where I could manipulate the, the wrap and just do however you wanna do with the wrap. Obviously, if you got bigger boobs, go with whatever size you like will fit. I don't honestly know how much material it would be. Cause you know, sometimes they be telling you, oh, small, medium, large for wraps, wrap top, and it's literally all the same size. So it's like most of them are one size fit all, but I just went with a small with this. And for the skirt, I went with a size medium. Now the skirt can be tricky. There, there, there was, I wouldn't say it's an issue with the skirt, but it was a close call with the skirt because it was this close to not being my correct size. Because there's literally no stretch in the skirt. Especially that part that is on your knee, it's like holding you like this to keep the shape of the skirt so you gotta walk real tight like i was trying to get into the car and i had to like sit and then roll my legs around to get into the car and even to sit in the restaurant that i went to so be mindful of that that you have very limited mobility in this skirt but it is so beautiful when you get the correct side it's just freaking bang again i went with my zara sandals because i'm like you know, I didn't feel like wearing any heels because I knew I was gonna might walk on the beach, walk by a pool, walk by something. I didn't want to wear heels with it. We could definitely wear heels with it. This is just my look. You feel me? And I couldn't find a bag to go with it. When you're on vacation, sometimes you're limited to what you normally have in your closet at home. So I just brought staple purses. So I went with my Louis Vuitton purse and just call it a day. Call it call it a day. <laughs> call it. I went with my Louis Vuitton bag and just call it a day. Now again, with my same accessory, you know, we, we can't leave these accessories behind. And that was basically it. I don't think I needed to do too much with this because the skirt at the top was already doing it for me. And that is it for my looks for vacation. That is my book book for my trip let me know what you guys think which looks were your favorite let me know what you guys think of this video or videos like this if you want me to do more lookbook type of videos for you guys this is my first one ever and i did this on a whim so it is what it is don't forget to subscribe to the channel follow me on instagram snapchat and twitter at damn that's chef all the links to the office that i featured I'm going to leave it down below for you guys unless it's sold out or I can't find it. But I'll just let y'all know, okay? And that is basically all that I have for y'all today. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Go on and video so, Bye guys. Mwah. Everything heavy when we step up. You can't hang with a gang, you are fellow. Yeah, everything check, come Stella. Let me 